All right, guys, we're back. This is uh, gonna be part two of, uh, of my stash video. And I'm starting off with some more semi trucks. Uh, here's my little stash of uh, K100 cab over Kenworth. There's a uh, W9 and a uh, K123. There's a lone Pete down there. 378 day cab. Let's get these out of the way. Go underneath the bench. Kind of hard to see down here. It's pretty dark. A few semi kits down there at the bottom. Motorcycle. Uh, my lone um, figure kit. Semi trucks in the corner. Uh, kind of hard to see. There's a uh, W9 1 16th scale on the bottom. There's a uh, W9 Wrecker. And then there's a couple more 123s. Uh, there's a couple of those um, Tennessee Thunder uh, transporters. Nine and a quarter. T600, the Pro Star, and there's uh, a bunch of different uh, car kits. Uh, a lot of these are double, double stacked under here. I don't even know what's in the front. A bit of everything down here. A little bit of everything still. And there's uh, two semi trucks. There's, uh, there's an airplane. Uh, that kit on the bottom is a uh, is a Volvo uh, semi truck, and then the one there on the bottom underneath the dozer that is a uh, Pete 378. Slide this into the picture. There's a big Pete 359. There's a Mobius uh, reefer on top. NASCO NASCAR combo kit. Now, a lot of these down here. I know it's kind of kind of hard to see. Pretty dark. Now, all these are uh, just open models. Um, pretty much anything down here at the bottom has been unstarted. To the best of my knowledge, everything is complete. This right here is what started it all. This was my first kit that I bought that I never built. This is an original issue, generally. I uh, don't remember the year, 76, 7, 8, 9, I don't, I don't know. Maybe somebody uh, could help me out. I'd pull it out, but I'd end up, I'd, the column would fall. But I bought this kit at a toy show back in like 92, 93, and... Uh, Never had any intentions of building it. You know, I've always wanted one. I thought it was really cool. Just, you know, that's that's what started the stash right there. Because up until that point, every model I bought, I always built. Now, there's a few up at the top here that, uh, you know, I've I've started a few few things. Uh, a couple of them I might have robbed some parts out of here and there. 
uh, over here in the corner uh, a lot of these on this wall here uh, well actually all these here uh, have either been started and uh, never finished uh, a lot of these are from years ago uh, at least 15 years maybe even longer uh, there are some of them that that um, I'm gonna say I've had for at least 20 years some of them uh, were were build ups that uh, some parts and pieces you know got broken off just never uh, got back to putting them back together and it goes all the way down there now, there's a bunch of stuff down there in the bottom you can't even see here's some more uh, just miscellaneous projects that I started never finished uh, down there there's a there's a bunch of semi kits that I started probably 10 11 years ago uh, never finished there's probably seven or eight of them down there and we got some more just uh, miscellaneous stuff stuff I gotta move out of the road as I show it There's, it continues things there down here at the bottom we have some big scale kits a couple a uh, couple more uh, 16th scale W9s the big uh, 57 Chevy Foos Camaro miscellaneous stuff there and then we got back over here on the table we got a stack of kits as well one of these you've seen uh, recently And then I have a bunch of, uh, you know, there's a couple semi trucks that I built years ago, never got them finished. They were put back in their boxes. Um, fortunately, they did survive the move. I uh, just dug them out and wanted to get them uh, started, but never, never got them finished. Um, you know, maybe over this winter I'll, I'll work at them and, you know, hopefully be able to get them done. But I do have a lot more stuff in my uh, in my back room uh, there's a couple more big uh, moving storage boxes back there that has a bunch of stuff in it and I don't remember what's in there uh, I got a bunch of just miscellaneous NASCAR kits that are uh, in, uh, in open baggies or you know shoe boxes with different um, different decals to build different cars uh, and there's a bunch of just like open kits that you know are like that as well. Uh, the boxes got wet, you know, and uh, so they're just in you know big uh, like gallon bags or uh, shoe boxes. And you know, I have no idea how many kits I have. Uh, I have way more than I'll ever build. You know, we could put a bunch of us together and we'd still never build all these. So, but anyhow, whatever. I mean, it's just something I like to do, something I like to collect. So, all right, guys, hope you enjoyed, and until next time, we'll talk to you later.